Hey guys, this is Don Marie with Sign Parties 101 and SunriseMarie.com, teaching you how to get started on your own DIY business. Now today we're doing something very simple, but a lot of times people don't know how to create it. For those of you with a laser and wanting to create an offset to your word, I'm gonna go over and show you how to create an offset in Silhouette Business. We are in Silhouette Studio Business Edition, and I'm gonna show you how to create a simple offset to a word. So you're gonna to wanna to click on the text button over here on the left, and I'm just gonna do a simple word that says welcome. So I'm gonna make it a little bit bigger. And now I always like to make my words black just so I can see them better, and I don't have that as my default. So I'm just gonna go over here and click the paint palette and make both the lines and the inside black. So. Okay, now we have our word and I'm gonna do it with a script font because I like script a little bit better than the print. So I just used vanilla cream, which is a nice script font. And to make the offset, it is very simple. We just wanna click on the word so it's highlighted and then go over to the offset button. Now you can find it at the top or on the side, depending on your screen and the way that you have the button set up but it's this little uh, star and I'm gonna click that and it's going to give just a little bit of an offset already, but in this menu, you can change the offset amount. So if you click this up arrow or the down arrow, it's gonna make that offset bigger or smaller. So I wanna either keep clicking it up or I can go ahead and just erase this and give it a different amount and see how that changes the word. So I want to create this a little bit bigger. Uh, maybe it's a little bit smaller. Okay, that looks good. And then I'll also show you how to remove those lines. So where uh, when you have it where you want it, just click off of it and that should create that offset. So when we go to cut it, we can move this word, cut this back, and then you have the word on it that you can just glue it on. Um, or you can do it as a stencil if you want. But let's say you got this offset, but you're like, I really don't like how, you know, it has these uh, holes in the middle. You can highlight this, right click it, release compound path. Okay, so then these pieces are going to be separate. And you can just go ahead and click your backspace or your delete and delete these little holes and then you have one solid piece that you can cut and then you can put your word on the top and that's how you create an offset. As you can see creating an offset is a very simple process. Hopefully this was helpful for you. Like and subscribe and I will see you in the next video.